Hey everybody, it is Biggie back today to review four lip glosses that were recently released from Fenty and this is the Rihanna collection. I did not pick up any of the other items so if that is what you're looking for you're probably gonna have to go somewhere else because um, I just, you know, I have enough eyeshadow palettes that I picked up lately because of the holidays and so I was kind of in a, a lip gloss lipstick mood and when I did my order with Sephora this week so that's what I picked up from this collection. So if you're interested in the four lip glasses, this is the place to be. So what I'll be doing is giving um, a review and also the swatches of the four colors so you can see what they look like. Oh, the color that I am wearing now is actually Astro Naughty, which is the darkest of the collection. Yes, it is absolutely fabulous. This is what it looks like up close and personal. It's this really beautiful kind of... Um, dark sparkly um, plum dark plum color and I absolutely love it so I'll be swatching the other ones but this is what this one looks like absolutely fabulous what I like about this collection is that for lip glosses they're really pigmented I, I will say that straight up they're pretty pigmented especially this color this is um this is astronauti is just amazing I think this is gonna be gorgeous on everybody you know it's not too warm it's not too cool it's like Goldilocks, man, it's perfect. <laughs> so this is gonna work for everyone. And that's what I actually liked about this collection is it's like it, it took every single person into consideration and made very wearable colors for everyone across the board. And I love seeing that. So I, I am definitely not disappointed. And they're actually very versatile too because I'm wearing this on its own, but you can definitely layer them on top of other lipsticks as well. Especially I find that they work better on matte lipsticks than they do um, on, on regular lipsticks because I, I feel with the regular lipsticks it's kind of wet on wet and it does definitely change it but I really think that the magic comes when you use it on a matte lipstick because it's matted down and you're working with the dry surface and then boom it just really makes it sparkle so I just but I love them that way but I also love them just naturally uh, with this one, obviously, the color is a little bit darker, so it, it's not that more natural look, but with some of the other ones, it's just a very, very light hint of color, and it's really nice if you want to wear a bold eye look, or um, you just want to go for a more natural look. As far as the formula, the formula isn't... It's, it's very thick. It's almost like a liquid lipstick, and I'm not talking a matte liquid lipstick. I'm saying it's almost like a liquid lipstick. So definitely not matte, but it's that style. Now it may not be as pigmented as that, but it definitely, as you can see, is very pigmented, just not as pigmented as your normal liquid lipstick, because again, this is a gloss. But I feel like it does have a lot of pigment for a gloss, and it's also very thick. So, you know, it's gonna last a long time, and I did feel that. I mean, most glosses are gonna wear off very quickly. There is transfer with this, obviously, because it is a gloss. But I feel like these lasted a very, you know, a decent amount of time. I, I, I really liked them because of that. I didn't see that I was reapplying it as often as some other glosses. Um, but it does have a thicker consistency to it. I kind of like that. I don't like the thinner gloss consistencies or where they're just too sticky. This is sticky, but not overly, if that makes sense. You know, when you press your lips together and you, man, and it's all stretchy and just, ugh, it's not like that. This is a very thick consistency. It stays where it's supposed to, but again, it is going to move. Just to show you, whoops, I had to look, there's the transfer. So, I mean, it's a gloss. <laughs> so, you know, you kind of expect that with the gloss, so nobody's shocked going, huh? Yeah, it's a gloss. So, fabulous colors. It does last, but there's going to be transfer if you're eating or drinking, but if you're just doing what you do every day, talking, going through the motions, it's going to last longer, of course, but I think in comparison to some glosses, it really has great staying power. I am going to go ahead and swatch the other three. Of course, this is the first, and this is Astro Naughty. I'm going to put it here as well so you can see what it looks like. Oops, kind of slobbed it on there, but there you go. It's just this beautiful, um, like, it's more of like a berry, a dark berry color. I was saying plum earlier, but it's more of a dark, shifting kind of berry color. Just really beautiful, and again, it's just so smart and gonna work so well on so many different skin tones. 
Okay, so before I start swatching the rest of these, um, I just want to show what the doe foot looks like. Here you go. As you can see, it's really long and narrow. So it wasn't necessarily the easiest wand for me to work with, but um, it was really no problem. But, you know, it, it isn't the most user friendly. It definitely doesn't bend or anything like that. It's very stiff, narrow, long, but you could definitely make it work. So again, this is Plutonic Relationship. And it's kind of this pink fuchsia color, which I love these. I'm a total sucker for these. <laughs> I always buy these. I have five billion of them and I need to stop. Plutonic relationship. So I really like this one. Again, I really love these um, fuchsia kind of colors. And what I love about it is the beautiful blue shift in it. Ah, uh, it's just absolutely gorgeous. You can see it here. You can definitely see it on the lips. It's just amazing. With this one, I'm a little bit more aware of the scent, actually, than I was with the um, Astronauti. I can definitely smell it. I think it's more when you first put it on and then it kind of dissipates, but it's just so moisturizing. And on this one, I don't feel the glitter quite as much as I did with Astronauti. So you definitely can't feel it as much with this one, which is Plutonic Relationship. And the color is just absolutely beautiful. You can see the pigment on this is amazing. And again, this is a gloss. And look at that. Dipped it in once, good to go. The next color is Gal on the Moon. Gal on the Moon. So I really like this one. I think it's a lot more docile than Plutonic Relationship. You can see here and even on the lips, it's a lot more user friendly. You know, Plutonic Relationship is a very bright pink, so it's more of a statement. While this one's a little bit more docile and user friendly for most. Um, I think you could even wear this in the office. You can wear this pretty much anywhere in any situation. I love this. I just think it's very versatile and it's gonna be so pretty on so many different people. I really love this color. I've worn it a few times and it's just absolutely beautiful and just adds a nice little hint of color more than the other ones which were a little bit more bold. And the last color is Spacesuit which is kind of the um, goldy, the gold kind of peachy shimmer color of the group. I know I did the opposite of what most people do. I went darkest to lightest. <laughs> you know, keep people on their toes. But um, here we go. So you can definitely see this one's a little bit harder to see. It is the lightest of the group, as I said, but it's almost actually more like a rose gold kind of color, which I kind of like. Um, definitely more of the warm tone of the group, while the two in the middle tend to be cool. And I really do think um, Astronauti is, is a little bit more neutral, can work with everyone, but all of these look fantastic. You know what? I am a cool tone girl, but I actually adore spacesuit, so it's not going to stop me. And I, I think it's just gorgeous. And you'll see because it's such a light color, it's just a hint. This is spacesuit. I love this one. I know on the arm it looks a lot more gold, but part of it is because, you know, obviously my arm is kind of a white slate and it doesn't have as much pigment as my natural lips. And so putting this onto your natural lips, what I like about this is it's very user friendly for everyone because there's a pink shift to it, which makes it kind of cool tone, but then the actual base is kind of a warmer tone, but it can go either way, which I just love. I, I just, that's what I love about these is that even though they can lean one, one way or the other, the shift in it makes it almost neutral so it could go with everyone's skin tone. This is just gorgeous. It's the lightest one. I wore this one as well. It just goes with like everything because it's just such a light hint of color. Um, I've been wearing it more with the warmer looks of fall. So if I do a gold eye look or a brown eye look and it's a little bit bolder than usual, then I will throw this on. And it's just so beautiful and easy to throw on on the weekend too if you want an easy eye look or an easy makeup natural look, throw this on. It is absolutely beautiful. I love this color. So what do I think of this collection? I think you know, but let's pull it into the end here. 
I love this. I absolutely love these. I think the colors are just so beautiful, user-friendly. I think these are perfect year in, year out. Maybe Astronauties more for this time of year into winter, but the rest of them you can wear any time of the year. I absolutely love them. The quality is really good. Um, the color selection is great. Some of them are still bold and interesting, but still very wearable, so it's not going too far over the top. And the packaging's really great. It's kind of this geometric look to it, and it's kind of like space age kind of stuff. I kind of like it. Also, there's a lot of product in there. I mean, look at that. That's a very generous amount there, you know, especially for the price point. Yes, it is a little bit more expensive. I'll put the price to the side. I already did at the beginning, but here you go again. Um, there's a lot of product in there and and I just I really love these I just do they wear really well they're really comfortable I just think they're beautiful colors I think they're beautiful across the board for everyone I give these really high praise I've enjoyed wearing these I will continue to and so yeah I think they're definitely worth it so let me know if you picked up any of these if you picked up anything else from the collection that you think maybe I should pick up because I just you know I, it, it's the holidays, so it's like I really have to kind of make sure I don't get too crazy. You gotta pay rent, you know? So, but let me know what you picked up, what you liked, if the collection even intrigued you. Because at first I wasn't sure, and then it kind of wrote me in once I saw some of these colors online. So, let me know. So until next time, have a fabulous day. Bye.